In this video, we're going to look at setting track time bases and the difference between sample based and tick based operation. As you can see, I have a simple session set up with two instrument tracks drums and bass. MIDI and instrument tracks use tick based timing by default. This means that each clip on the track is tied to a particular bar and beat location, and their position and duration can change based on the session tempo and meter. In this case, the session started at 120 beats per minute. But if I increase the tempo, the MIDI data will play back faster. And if I decrease the tempo, the data will play back slower. However, if I change the track to sample-based operation by clicking on the time base selector, the clips on the corresponding track are now tied to a particular sample location in the session and will not respond to any subsequent changes made to the tempo or meter. Audio tracks default to sample-based operation and therefore must be changed to tick-based operation if you intend to use the Pro Tools tempo matching features available in Elastic Audio.